Our next guest not only changed the lives of each other through a simple act of kindness, but also inspired people from all over to pay it forward. Take a look. Is the TV ready to order? It's not coffee now. It's not coffee? Yeah. You got it. I came in at 8 o'clock at night. It was a pretty normal shift. I was supposed to be done at 4 o'clock in the morning. I had just finally cleaned up the whole place and in walked two firefighters. I knew that they had had a heck of a night, and I actually made the decision to pay for their check. And instead of just telling them, I decided to write them a note. My immediate reaction was, I gotta take a picture of this and put this on Facebook. Just thinking, like, people needed to know that there was somebody out there like Liz. It's changed our lives, <laughs> and I feel like that's an understatement to say. After everyone had been sharing the uh, post that I made on Facebook, I got a message that said Liz was actually trying to raise money for her father who was quadriplegic. And I immediately was like, okay, I gotta share this too. Well, my father, Steve, had a brain aneurysm rupture five years ago. He's always been a remarkable man. Can you believe I'm saying that? <laughs> um, he always stressed what you say is what you get, and what you put out into the universe, you will receive. She literally took money out of her pocket knowing that she needs to take care of her father to help us out. It takes a lot of heart for a person to do something like that for somebody. I launched the fundraiser in December. Our original goal was to get my father a used van. Ever since I met the two of them for breakfast last month, we're up to over $80,000 now. All it took was a nice gesture, just being kind, and it came back. I'm just so thankful. From Burlington County, New Jersey, please welcome Liz, Tim, and Paul. This is the letter you left. Your breakfast is on me today. Thank you for all that you do, for serving others, for running into places everyone else runs away from. No matter your role, you are courageous, brave, and strong. Thank you for being bold and badass every day, uh, fueled by fire and driven by courage. What uh, an example you are. Get some rest, Liz. That's amazing, and I ditto that. I, I love firefighters, and thank you so much for everything you do. It's thank amazing. Thank you. Um, thank so, you. <laughs> so what what kind of impact uh, has that been on the two of you? Uh, well, you, you know, it's just the greatest thing about all of this is not really what Liz did or what Paul and Tim did. It's what the world did. The response that I that we got just from a simple Facebook post that everyone came together to just help you know a regular regular wonderful person like Liz yeah it's great it, it really is just one act of kindness like I said the ripple effect that that has and hopefully someone watching here today helps somebody else who helps somebody else which is mm. so important and uh, I what was the name of the where do you work the Route 130 Diner. Route 130, and you go there a lot, right? We do now, for sure. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, Shutterfly wants to pay for the next five years. It's on, so eat a lot. The next five years, <laughs> it's all taken care of. Oh they goodness. are paying for your meals. So wow. that is. Uh, <laughs> That's awesome. So, Liz, you work nights, right? So yes. that you can stay home and care for your dad during the day. Yes. Which is amazing, because you could move out, you could live somewhere else, but you stay at home to help your mom, so take care of your dad. Well, it's a commitment. Yeah. You know, um, if we weren't taking care of him at home, he would be in a nursing home. Right. And he had already spent 567 days in hospitals, nursing right. homes, rehab, so. So he's home now, and he gets to uh, watch the show. <laughs> Hi, what's his name? Steve. Steve. Hey, Steve. How you doing? <laughs> um, so you paid it forward. I would like to pay it forward to you right now. And Shutterfly wants to give you a check for $20,000. <laughs> <laughs> How awesome, right? That's great.